So, as you guys all know, um, we're going to Tunisia. We're leaving in a couple of days. So, it's a bit emotional. We're kind of happy. We're sad. Happy to leave. Sad because of Finn. So, emotions a bit crazy. Brittany's been up and down. I've been up and down. Crying. Happy. Sad. You can't explain it. Anyway, I'm trying to keep this happy. So, we're not going to discuss all the sad stuff. So, basically, as you all know and as you should know, we got AIS. You should know that because I told the whole world in one of our last videos. We got AIS and the whole marina knows. So anyway, if you haven't seen it, watch that video. Now, it couldn't have come at a better time because as the whole world also knows, a ship got stuck in the Suez Canal. It's causing billions of dollars of holdups all around the globe. And the Suez Canal got out a little five ton digger <laughs> to dig out a massive, one of the biggest ships in the world. What does RAS have to do with the biggest ship in the world being stuck? What does our AIS have to do with the biggest ship in the world being stuck? <laughs> so, it's really hard crossing through night. When you've got these massive container ships, you know, we've done tons of night sails and you just, you never get used to it. As soon as you see a light in the distance, you're like, fuck, what is it? You're watching, it's getting closer. Some of these massive ships have four lights on them. I'm like, man, what's it mean when you got like that on that? And so I get the little book out, I'm looking at the light. It's just stressful. Then you get closer and then you get closer and then you like, you want to veer course because you're getting scared, but you don't want to veer course because you don't want to confuse them either. So with the Suez Canal being stuck, a lot of ships are going around the bottom of Africa and they're coming up into Europe through the other way. If you look at AIS right now, we're going straight across here to Tunisia, right? And it is a huge amount of traffic through there. It was perfect timing getting AIS right now. Oh yeah, did I say we're going to Tunisia in a few days? Alrighty, we are starting to get ready to go. So one thing I'm gonna do to prep for our passage, it's only a 24 hour passage, but I don't feel like cooking while we're on our way, so I'm gonna cook some meals. I'm gonna do some sweet chili chicken that we can just boil some rice and have with veggies. I'm gonna do a chicken curry. Mind the mess, I'm folding laundry. I just like to be prepared so I don't have to do anything while we're actually moving. So let's do this. chicken curry which letting cool down and sweet chili chicken for wraps and stuff look at the mess we're living in still i just got home and i've got to clean up but i just need to have a siesta we're in italy <laughs> and we're gonna have to say goodbye to little yeah. hi mister yeah. okay this is our little foster. His name's Lion. And he's not feeling very well. He's on medicine because him and his siblings all contracted a virus. And his siblings died. He's the only one left. But he's doing well. He just needs his medicine to kick in. He's got a bit of a whistle in his lungs. So it's been good to be able to take care of him. After trying to find Finn for so long and having no luck, we needed something positive to do. Didn't we? I'm gonna be sad to say goodbye to you too. Show everybody your whistle. Mm -hmm. Can you show everybody your whistle? Mm -hmm. Made him a little bed in the sink because he was laying in it. <laughs> mm -hmm. So we're going to drop Lion off to Sarah, who's going to take care of him. It's alright mate. So Brittany's going to drop Lion off, I'll go with her. Say bye to David and Sarah. And then 
We're gonna sort this boat out to leave in the morning. Yeah. Hey, where are we going? We're going to get COVID tests. Where are we? <laughs> Sicily. We're leaving Sicily. To go to Tunisia. We're not going to Tunisia. Huh? We're going to where Luke Skywalker was born. Asteroid Polo's master, unacknowledged to their father Anakin Skywalker, aka the Sith Lord Darth Vader, after his mother died. During labor, Luke was separated from his sister and taken <laughs> by Jedi up. Master Obi Wan Kenobi to the planet of Tatooine. This is gonna be a long taxi ride. <laughs> <laughs> So this is Sicily, like to a T right here. So we're in this big lineup for the COVID test. And this lady in the red car, oh, you can't see her now, is trying to cut in. Our taxi driver's like, the line's back there. What are you doing there? You must go back. Oh, okay, yeah, Ryan. Come on, come up front, Vinny. Yeah. Oh my God, my butt. Be careful, be very careful. Sorry, Angelo. <laughs> So this is it. Go Steve-o. <laughs> Don't cry Steve. <laughs> sorry, I'm sorry I should have said that. Oh pretty. Oh god I'm scared. <laughs> Say uh. Go Brittany. Uh, uh, don't you oh guys not all over me. <laughs> don't make me laugh. <laughs> okay that's fine. Oh god. <laughs> 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 you made me laugh. Feels like she's still up there. Oh, uh, that was uneventful. Oh, <laughs> I think you could, oh, I think you could have called out or something. Brittany wants to see the puppies so bad now. All right, see you, Brittany. <laughs> we'll bring you a cup of coffee, okay? Uh, yeah. Hold on, hold on, sweet cheeks. We're gonna push this down. Oh, you need a new joke. They say your man doesn't take care of you. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Oh. Oh. Okay. Oh, good. oh look. Oh my god, she's so cute. So he rents this out as an Airbnb. Airbnb. Whoa. 1750, Ryan. 1750? Yeah. So, here's your ocean view. Oh, wow. Look at this. Oh, that is beautiful. Ryan, do you want to buy a house? Yeah. Been. And you got all this out here, too. Oh, that's that beautiful mansion again. Yeah. Oh, lost my shoe. <laughs> Peppa! Oh, Peppa, 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 Hello! Hello! Oh no, that's my beanie! You can't take that! <laughs> Downstairs, down here, Angelo's making coffee for us, which is cool. Hello, come on, Peppa. Look at the light in front of you. Oh, bye. That's, that's, that's the Sicilian. See, there's a well inside the house. You making a mess now? <laughs> <laughs> Hello. You're so funny. You are so funny. Yes, you are. Do so you reckon that's an old olive tree, eh? Brittany, stop stealing your lemons. Oh, it smells good. <laughs> Thank you. Ciao. 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 So this is our boat. We've got <laughs> the stairs sitting here. We've got our search and rescue transponder sitting there on top. Brittany on her phone. Got garbage. We have a jug of water, Jackson, 
We just got stuff everywhere, eh? Yeah. We're leaving in the morning. <laughs> we still haven't said bye to everyone. And today when we were supposed to get our boat organized, we were out searching for Finn. Anyway, we're going to stay up all night, sort this out. We're going to leave at 10 now. All right, we're getting ready to leave. It's our last night. I'm really excited to see Tunisia in a new place, but I'm sad at the same time, but it'll be okay. Ryan's upstairs getting the boat ready. I'm getting everything stowed away. In the meantime, we're also gonna send our donation to the rescue here in Lakata because they've been absolutely hammered with puppies this year and the puppy season hasn't even started yet. They need as much help as they can get. Thanks to you guys, we have been able to give them a nice donation and also just as a thank you for everything they did to help us out with our rescues, helping rehome our puppies and some of the cats we rescued while we were here. So they've been really good to us. It's just a bit of a thank you. So I'm gonna send it now. Thanks to all you guys who donated. We've been able to do so much here for these animals here in Sicily. We We've also got about a thousand euro here spare that we're going to donate to them. They even have been working their ass off to try and help us find Finn. So. Yeah, we'll keep helping the animals when we go to Tunisia. We might find some. We'll keep doing our thing. All right, you ready? Casa Rifugio. Can't say the rest. Yeah, I actually can't say it. Go. Continue. Ready? Yep. <gasps> I didn't read it. <gasps> What the heck? We can't complete this transaction. The recipient has exceeded the receiving limit. What if we did like 9999? Woo! All right. All right, see? We've literally, we said bye to everyone. I oh, know, there's a few people that went on their boat. But... Oh, Ingmar. Oh, Ingmar, Ingmar. We went by to say bye to you. Dead. And you're still in bed. Ema, I'm very upset. That's a shame, but we said bye to everyone. We ran through and said bye to everyone this morning. I'm just disconnecting the shore power and get ready to go. difficult I mean usually we're all excited and happy and we're moving but it's been really emotional leaving and then when we pulled out we had the wind against us it wasn't a smooth a smooth it was exit not our best exit. <laughs> it wasn't our best but the uh, the bow line the other boat was out in front of us and it kind of like kind of like pulling us into them into the boat next to us I a, think we actually took it with us yeah we kind of took the bow line with us a bit which is a bit annoying but uh, the fenders did their job though I messaged the people next to us, they're not there on their boat, they haven't been there all winter, but I just mentioned and said, hey look, if there's, if there's a scratch or a mark or something, let us know, we'll fix it, but I think it's alright. We'll probably look back on the footage and go, oh shit, that was bad. <laughs> alright, well, we'll get these sails out, we got about 40 knots of wind, we're still motoring, but we'll get the sails out. The wind's a bit on our nose, we can't waste too much time because we've left so late, we've got to get there before nightfall tomorrow. You know what, it makes it easier for me. I keep saying to Brittany, you know, we're just crossing the little pond here to Tunisia. So we can come back and there's heaps of people there we know that can grab him. So we haven't lost hope, but it is, it is really tough to leave. All right, let's get these sails out. 